everybody, I'm Kelsey Foremost. This is Showtune Kitchen, and today we are making suddenly seafood. <laughs> we are making shrimp sriracha stir fry, inspired by Little Shop of Horrors. So if you've got little ones yelling, feed me, but you don't wanna make the same boring thing over and over, try this delicious, flavorful, easy recipe. What you're gonna need is a pound of shrimp, some sriracha sauce, about a pound of fresh asparagus. We are gonna cut these into one inch pieces, three cloves of diced garlic, about a tablespoon of fresh ground ginger. You can use a cheese grater to do this, by the way. This is what fresh ginger root looks like. You can also use powdered ginger, but I really find with this recipe, fresh is best. Then you're gonna need the juice of one lime, one onion, which we are going to slice, and some cilantro for garnish, if you're into that sort of thing. I think this is such a delicious recipe. It's become one of the go-tos in my house, and I hope you guys love it as much as we do. Okay, everybody, we have been sauteing the onions and the garlic for about three minutes until translucent. And I sauteed it with a little bit of toasted sesame seed oil. You can use whatever oil you have in the house, but toasted sesame seed oil really does bring out that nice Asian dish flavor. Next, we are going to evenly distribute our ground ginger. And once this goes in and combines with the garlic, you're really gonna start to smell that incredible fragrant spice that comes out of this dish. We're also gonna add half of our lime. Get that nice sizzle. Mm. Again, wishing for smell-o-vision for you guys. It smells incredible. Oh. So now that that is all nice and juicy and delicious, we are going to add our asparagus. Now you'll notice I chopped the asparagus into about one to two inch pieces. Um, I prefer to eat stir fry this way. You could keep them whole, but um, once you chop the ends off, you can either just put them right in the pan or you can chop them into these one inch pieces to make it easier to fry and eat. Now, the key with this dish and one of the reasons that it's so easy is the timing. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna leave this for two minutes maybe until the asparagus is about, like not quite halfway cooked. At that point, we are going to add our raw shrimp. This has been defrosted and it's ready to go right in the pan with the tails on. So why we do that is shrimp takes about three to five minutes to cook through depending on the size. These are pretty big jumbo shrimp, so I'm gonna give them a little bit longer. But how you know shrimp is done is it starts out kind of gray like this, and then each side, um, you wanna make sure it's evenly cooked. So it's gonna get that nice, beautiful, pearly pink color. And once it is all the way pink, you wanna turn the heat off in the stir fry and stir this up a little bit and make sure that you get the other side of the shrimp. And you want to, um, you don't want to overcook it. So you want it to just be that beautiful, bright, white and pink shrimp color. And then that is when you are going to take it off the heat, let it sit for a minute, and then give it a second before you serve. So we've been cooking this asparagus. It's looking pretty good. It's getting green. And now I'm going to add my shrimp right in there. And I'm gonna stir it in. And I'm gonna let this sit for a couple of minutes. And pretty quickly, the gray shrimp is gonna to start to become pink. And then I'm gonna flip it to the other side, make sure it's even, turn that heat off, and serve it over a nice bed of rice. Now the last thing that you wanna do while it's in this stir fry is give it, oh, this is not open, you want to give it a dash of this 
spicy sriracha. Now this sriracha, I might have gone a little overboard there. I'm not gonna lick this off my finger. I learned that the hard way. So sriracha is one of those really amazing kind of all purpose flavors that really brings out a nice spice in any Asian dish that you're cooking. I highly recommend you have some just on hand. Um, if you've got something that's kind of like meh, bland and boring, throw a little sriracha on there, boom, you've got something that's not, that uh, tastes like it came from a really nice takeout place. So I don't know if you guys can see, but the shrimp are starting to get a little more pink. So what I'm gonna do is give it a minute flip them over to the other side and then I'll show you guys the finished product. Okay everybody, we made it. This is our beautiful shrimp sriracha stir fry. We've got those beautiful green asparagus and onions, garlic, ginger, and our delicious suddenly seafood. We topped it with a little bit of somewhere that's green, a little something that's green some cilantro, and then a little tiny drizzle of sriracha on top if you like a little bit of extra spice. Don't go too crazy or it'll be overpowering. Gives it that nice color for serving as well. Thank you so much for showing up and tuning in. I'm Kelsey Foremost, and this is Showtune Kitchen. I'll see you next time.